Once astronomers accepted that expansion is accelerating, the next challenge was measuring how fast. Using observations from the WMAP and Planck satellites, scientists mapped the cosmic microwave background, the afterglow of the Big Bang. It revealed the universe's precise geometry and composition. According to these maps, about 68% of the universe is dark energy, 27% dark matter, and only 5% normal matter. Everything we can see, stars, planets, people. That means most of reality is invisible to our senses. Dark matter pulls galaxies together. Dark energy pushes them apart. It's a cosmic tug of war, and dark energy is winning. The exact nature of dark energy remains one of the biggest open questions in physics. Is it Einstein's cosmological constant, an inherent energy of space itself, or is it something dynamic, like a new quantum field slowly changing over time? Some models suggest a property called quintessence, a hypothetical energy field that varies with time and location. If quintessence is real, the fate of the universe could depend on how it evolves. We test these ideas by observing distant galaxies, supernovae, and the cosmic microwave background. Future missions like Euclid, ESA, and Nancy Grace Roman Telescope, NASA, aim to map cosmic acceleration in unprecedented detail. They'll measure how structures like galaxy clusters grow over time, revealing how dark energy influences cosmic evolution. If the data ever show that the rate of acceleration changes, it could mean dark energy itself changes, hinting at new physics. What's fascinating is how this discovery began with simple light. By studying the faint glow of dying stars, humanity uncovered a force shaping the destiny of everything. It's a reminder that the universe hides its biggest secrets in the smallest details. In 2003, the Nobel Prize in Physics honored the teams behind this revelation. Their work didn't just change astronomy, it reshaped our view of reality. For the first time, we realized the cosmos isn't coasting. It's accelerating into an unknown future. Today, cosmologists continue refining measurements using baryon acoustic oscillations and gravitational lensing. These methods test whether general relativity still holds at cosmic scales, or whether dark energy signals something deeper. The deeper we look, the more precise our data become, but also, the stranger 